Hello everybody and welcome back to a video. I'm back, yippee. Today I decided just to do a how I film my RRP videos and so yeah, let's just get on to it. So I film with QuickTime Player. It comes free with an Apple device and so it makes it super easy for me to go and record audio and my screen. For me, I just have to go to file, um, new screen and new audio recording and then I'm recording. For me to start filming the intro, I'm going to go to settings and I'm going to adjust my field of view just so that it's closer. We'll be cropping when we get to editing, but I'm going to go to chat and going to go to the emoticon talk and once she's done doing her kicking thing i'm just gonna talk and then let her talk through her little thing and then we're completed finishing the filming the intro but to lead your horse it starts it zooms out quite far so i'm going to adjust my field of view again to be closer in and then i'm just going to put the halter on and stuff that you have to do before you lead and then i'll just lead and i'll try and pick the best angle that I think would be best for the video, and I'll just play around with it. So for tacking up slash grooming, I'm always in the grooming up stall just because it's easier and I can have the emotions of bathing your horse. So I'm going to immediately go to the grooming one and place my camera in a corner so that it's easy for me to um, see everything that's happening on my screen. And then, yeah. When it's time to switch to the other side, I'm just going to switch to the other side and then we'll edit it to make a little bit more smooth um, when we get to editing. I like to wait about 10 seconds before I end it. So for tacking up, it gets a little bit more tricky. So I'm going to open my backpack and my chat and bring my backpack over to the side by the chat so that when I crop it, you can't see it. And then I'm going to do the emotion no. And then I'm just going to go up to the saddle pad and double click it so that it goes on. And then I'm going to repeat that again to put the saddle on, double clicking each time. And then for the bridle, I'm going to walk to the front and I'm going to do the emotion happy. Again, it is a little bit difficult, but it just takes time and effort and practice. And so I'm going to do the emotion happy and put the bridle on like that. For putting on my helmet, I bring my backpack over to above the chat, just like I did for um, tacking up. And then I'm going to do the not listening emotion while double clicking my helmet to make it look like I'm putting it on that way. When I film the mount, I wanna make sure that I'm already sitting on my horse and then I'm going to dismount and that's the part I need. So I want to have it in a good angle that I like. And so I'm going to dismount and then I'm just gonna mount again so that I am actually sitting on my horse. So for filming different angles, I'm just going to pr pretty much just play around with how I want it to look and just figure out the best angles. I like this behind one because it makes it much easier for me to film and then I can I also do one right in front. That one's a meh one, but then there's also the one that's in the front off to the side. That one's probably the most difficult to film because I do not know what is in front of me and so I have a lot of mishaps during that one, just like kind of running into different things and stuff like that. So to film the outro, I'm going to adjust my field of view again 
and I'm just going to pretty much do the same thing that I did for the intro, but for the outro. And I'm just going to make sure I don't have my helmet on because that is a mistake that you can see actually in a lot of my videos. And so I'm just going to do the same thing that I did for my intro. And yeah, that's about it. So to edit, I use um, iMovie because it just came free with my device. And so I use that to edit. And so yeah, let's just get on to editing. So once I'm in iMovie, I created a new movie and I'm going to go ahead and import media and I have saved the clips that I needed of the actual roleplay and so I'm going to go ahead and import those and begin to edit. To crop clips, I'm going to go over to the crop thing and I'm just going to crop it so that you cannot see the um, user interface like your name and the map just so that it looks a little bit more realistic and then I'll double check that it's good and then we'll be done cropping and I'm just going to do that to every other clip that I need to crop. For editing leading my horse I'm going to find where I kind of stop moving my camera around and I'm going to just make sure that I have everything that I need and then I'm just going to split the clips by doing command B and then that's how I edit that and I make sure it's cropped. So for editing tacking up it's just a lot of trial and error and cropping and clipping so as soon as I see that her hands are down I'm going to split the clip and I'm going to crop it so that I can only see the horse and none of the backpack or map or anything like that. Um, and I'm just going to repeat that over and over again for different, the, like the saddle, and then I'll do the same thing for the bridle. So for editing riding clips, I'm going to just play around and see what angles I like, and I'm going to crop where I like them and then delete the extra stuff. And then I'm just going to repeat that all over again just until I'm completed finishing that. So for the outro, I'm going to do the same thing that I did for the intro, just for the outro, and then that's that. So I figured I would do a couple, like answering a couple questions that you might have after you've watched this video. So the first one is, how do I come up with my storyline? So pretty much I just wanted her life to be as much as I wanted mine to be like, and so that included being around horses all of her life. I'm um, getting opportunities to do that and all that stuff. The next one is how long do I spend on my RPs? So it definitely depends on the video. A video like the one that you're going to see next week that I filmed for this video, it only took me probably an hour and a half to film and edit just because of how short it is. But to like other ones like my morning routines and those routine videos those definitely take a lot longer and then so it just pretty much depends on the role play but I can spend up to six hours on them a couple days so it really depends the last one is do I script my videos so it really depends again the video because sometimes I do sometimes I don't the bigger ones, like I want to come up with like a huge thing but that I want to script, but I can't think of anything, so that one will be scripted, but these ones are not, and so this is just going off of me talking, whatever I want to say is going on. So yeah, thank you for watching. Um, uh, if you liked it, make sure to like and subscribe. Anyways, bye! Also enjoy this little reveal of the roleplay coming out next week. Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. So today I decided to bring you along a get ready with me for a trail ride plus trail ride. I'm going to be riding Royal and... This is love if I'm making you breakfast. This is love if I feel myself coming down. You're not around. 
love if I think I've gone crazy This is love if you see 